In this video, we will learn what's new in the new version of Tesla Cicada 23. First of all, we got possibility to add U OPC UA server in your project. It's a, let's demonstrate how to work it. Let's check use OPC UA server, choose TCP port and choose policy that you want to use in your project. If you want to use anonymous policy, it lets any user to add your server to get server data. If you want to use username password policy, you can get uh, only users that added in this project will have possibility to get data from your project. Enter certificate name and enter period of validity of certificate. Click OK. And now let's add server in our project. We'll get that data from Modbus server with address, for example, 41. And click OK. And now we'll cre create Text. First of all, we add text group. For example, department one and add subgroup. For example, and add parameters to this object. For example, start, stop, and add address of a pod bus. For example, Voltage and 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 for example, speed. For this stack, we'll create alarms. For example, if speed higher some value, will be message speed is too high. And, and create history, for example. Yeah. Okay. You can create graphical objects for this project, but we use this project only for providing data with OPC UA server. Let's load this project on our, our PC and We load project cre created with created OPC server on other PC and now let's create project to read data from the OPC server and provide it by using graphical objects. Let's create project. We placed our PC server on the PC with address 
41 and port 8666. We use anonymous policy in our project. Let's create tags. You can create groups and subgroups like in our projects provided with OPC Acer, but I will not do it. You can add any name, not like in our, not like in our PC server. And now let's connect to our PC server and the name of the main folder is is the same like name of our project. Now let's browse through our parameters and choose start and stop and add other our parameters And now create graphical objects. For example, for Boolean value, we'll choose a button and bind to it. And go. Other parameters, let's choose simple label and choose our text, for example, voltage. We'll add possibility only for reading this data from our PC server. Let's add bottom and filling. And for voltage, the same. For speed, the same for object. And let's start it by using Tesla's SCADA runtime. You can see our connected, our object can connect it to the RPC server and get data from through RPC server from the MAD bus simulator. Let's change data in our MAD bus simulator and see the same, for example, I enter value for voltage 45 and 8. It's 46. Let's change decimal position and, for example, and here, for example, two. And load this project again and see forty five and eight. 
and for speed for example 76 and 4 our PCA server read data from the Modbus simulator or Modbus device in your, in your case and provide it for our PCA cl client in this project and you can see 76 and 4 and now let's try to add history and events add hist reading history and events to do this you should add for example for reading data from our motor object you should add motor 1 and check enable OPCU event and now you, you can you should read connect to the our PCA server and select this object motor one and for reading trends you should add trend of PCA history and history for speed you should enable history in our text for client now add this parameter to our collection in trends let's open this project for in runtime and let's try to change our speed over 90 for example 95 yes we get this value from our OPCA server and now let's change some values of our speed and let's see the value on our trend let's change time for example and you can see our trends value read it from our OPC server it's you can use this project not only for PC of clients not only for PC also you can use for mobile on mobile devices and connect to the same OPC server OPC server you, you can use only on PC versions of Tesla SCADA to run time. Thank you for your watching and if you have any questions please email us or ask them in our forum.